Hey guys, what's up? Uh, NMN, Res Virtual, and Met Foreman. Combining the three, I'm taking three together right now, as recommended by Dave Sinclair. Uh, the NMN. NMN has been amazing for me. Uh, my energy has been off the charts. I have never felt better. I'm 42, very active, fairly fit, and um, the NMN has been absolutely amazing. And I've taken NR as well. I've kind of... Um, dabble between the two of them. Both of them have been really good. Boost your natural NAD, uh, give you like a natural, a basically like a natural high. You just feel better, you just function better. It's not like a stimulant, it doesn't buzz you out, it doesn't wig you out, you just naturally feel and perform better. Uh, I don't touch pre-workouts anymore. I haven't touched pre-workouts since I started NMN. Uh, it's just so good. There is virtual been taking for two months. Um, I find my endurance has been through the roof. I'm feeling a lot better. My endurance is way better. Um, the thing with these, like you start to take it, you feel this dramatic difference and then it just kind of becomes a normal. So like, I think I've seen a lot of comments of people like, yeah, I felt a lot at the start. Now I don't notice anything at all. I think because your energy has gone up, you're functioning better and you're just taking it for granted now. That's now your new normal. So my new normal, I would say, is 50% higher, 50% uh, more energy. From the moment I wake up, I've mentioned this in many videos, from the moment I wake up to 12 o'clock at night when I go to bed, I just feel and function so much better, so much more energy, I get so much more done, especially late at night, I work for myself, I do photography, videography, things like that. I'm editing 10, 11, 12 o'clock at night, and I feel like I'd, I would at 9 o'clock in the morning. Uh, the metformin. Metformin, I was a little bit hesitant being a drug and not a supplement. I uh, did my research, watched countless amount of videos, things like this. People are taking it. Being a healthy uh, individual, I was like, why should I take metformin? The more research I did, the more I learned about side effects. I've been taking 850 milligram tablets. Um, I eased into it, I built up to it, but I take 850 milligram tablets at my last meal of the day. Um, and it's been great. The difference between uh, berberine and metformin is night and day. Like Dave Sinclair says, it's like berberine is like the poor man's metformin. If you can get more metformin over berberine, I 110 recommend it. It's so much better. The things I've noticed is just digesting, breaking down those carbs, wake up in the morning, very empty, very, very, very skinny, just like, just very at rest. And if you don't know what I do, I do fasting, I do intermittent fasting, I do OMAD, have done for the last couple of months. I've been fasting for the last three to four years, but OMAD for the last two to three months. And having that one meal and then taking metformin afterwards, you just wake up so settled, so empty, and you feel so good. And there's a lot of side effects that come with it. The thing that I learned is the more unhealthy you are, the more side effects you're gonna, you're gonna get because of the metformin. But the metformin is also gonna give you the beneficial and give you the benefits, which kind of gets you get to that, it's kind of this catch 22. You're gonna have to go through the, the side effects to get to the healthy benefits. The side effects for me has just been um, just burping, just very burpy here and there. This morning, actually, I woke up, I must have burped like 10 times. And because I eat clean, I eat well, I don't burp. So I know 110% it's from the metformin. So overall, taking the NMN, there is virtual in the metformin together, I feel really good. I feel very, very, very good. I got a lot of energy. I'm training hard, I'm feeling good, I'm functioning well. I've definitely got an enhanced mood. And it's not like I'm an unhappy person. I think because I feel and I function so much better, um, I just feel better, I'm happier. Uh, the metformin, I feel like that's helping like just utilize those carbohydrates. Generally, I eat pretty good carbohydrates anyway, like low glycemic index carbohydrates, because that's the best thing to eat if you are gonna eat carbs. Um, but overall, those three have been absolutely amazing for me. I feel like I'm potentially looking younger, like I'm 42. I feel like I look quite healthy for my age, uh, besides these greys that I'm stuck with. Um, 
do I recommend you getting on these things? NMN 110%. 100%. I'm, I'm telling everybody about it. Nobody's doing it. Nobody's listening. And I'm like, okay, I'll just keep doing my thing. I'll keep feeling better. And the ones that do eventually catch on, like you guys watching this, uh, it's going to change your life. You're going to feel so much better. And getting these mixed comments where, oh, you've got affiliate with this. You're making money from it. No, I'm not. This is just something that I read a lot. I read 60 books a year and that's business, fitness, things like that. I like to learn. And then if I learn something, I like to apply it because there's no point knowing something unless you apply it. So I'm learning about these supplements. I'm learning about what they do. I'm learning about what they potentially can do. And I'm trying for myself and I'm not being stupid. I'm not taking silly risks. I'm taking educated decisions. And for me, the NMN has been amazing. Boosting your NAD will give you more energy and you will feel better. There is virtual. I don't know. I've mixed opinions on that one. If you take too much, it, is, it will thin your blood. I think that's what gives you an endurance. I think that's what makes you kind of function that little bit better. I did take too much one time. It gave me an epic nosebleed. It was really bad. It was at a restaurant. My nose was bleeding. It was coming out like a tap. But that's because I doubled my dosage the day before because I thought I was taking the right amount. Only to find out I probably was taking the right amount and I took the wrong amount. So it gave me an excess nosebleed and it was very hard to clot and I don't really get nosebleeds. So it was quite embarrassing and quite messy. And then the metformin, if you are overweight, you are unhealthy, you probably are going to have side effects because I had very, very mild side effects and I'm quite healthy and I eat quite well. Um, there's been a few times where I've had like a cheat meal, I've had chocolate and I've woken up at 12 o'clock at night. I've had this like I nearly felt like I was going to throw up, to be honest. And it's happened maybe two times over the space of the month. And um, I don't know what it is. It's just the way the metformin helps digest your food. I guess the sugar, the carbohydrates, and the chocolate. There's been two times I've nearly vomited from it. But I've been good. I've been close, but I've been good. So the cleaner you eat with any of this, especially the metformin, uh, the better it's going to be for you. So you got questions, uh, you want to know which ones I'm taking, you want some more feedback, uh, leave a comment, show a subscribe, and um, thanks for watching guys. I'll see you next time.